Hello fellow Ghostbusters and welcome to another episode of Amnesia White Knight. In the last episode I went to that bathroom and the bathroom was just a whole bunch of nope. And then I got lost and I couldn't figure out what to do. So, this episode, we are totally going to figure out what to do and my webcam is going to glitch a whole bunch. So sit back, relax, and enjoy this episode of Amnesia White Knight. You out here, Philip? Was it Philip? Yeah, it's definitely Philip. I got a little confused over the names. There's like Philip and there's Patrick and I don't know. I don't know who any of them are. It's enough of that. Let's get things done. Did I get anything in my inventory? I have a screwdriver still, I guess. It's good for doing screwy stuff. I don't think I've... What the fuck? Cock a son of a bitch. What'd that do? What, is the, what, what does these do? What does these do? There's nothing I can... Wait, what? How? But why? What did... What does... What does these do? Maybe these are switches that open the doors? Maybe? Possibly? Let's try it. No. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try... I don't, I don't know. No. Nope, that does nothing. So this is Dr. S it's my favorite doctor in the world. Let's throw it open. Okay, let's stop wasting those batteries. Freaking light. Stupid. I'm not getting any, like, journal entries or anything, am I? A note to you. Annoying her. Oh wait, there was a, okay, sh I know it's a four digit, so it has to be some kind of code. Uh, wait, 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 let's go back to that. Let's go, let's read that. Annoying her. Three, two. Number three, two, four. Three, two, four. Five. I'm gonna figure this out. Or something's gonna tell me. Something's going to reveal itself. Dr. Patrick! Tell me how to get past your magic. Maybe I'll just sit here and make creepy faces until something happens. Five. Number one. Okay, so the first one is five. I got this. Okay, so there's gonna be little clues scattered throughout. So five. Where are the other ones? Where are the other numbers I gotta find? Anything? So the first one's five, the third one is two. Based on the note. So it's five, something, two, and there's gotta be another number in here somewhere. Fuck off. Uh, there's gotta be another, another number. You got a number for me? No? Oh yeah, that's right, I already did that. It led to nothing. It was just a bunch of nothing. I don't have anything. I don't have a single damn thing. It got real quiet in here. It's gonna get loud as I get out there again, I'm sure. Go! So, five. Bleh. Two, right? Right? I read that right? Five, two. Where's the next number? Five, there's gotta be something in the bathroom, I bet. I'm not done with the creepy bathroom, I'm sure. Where are you? Shut up, White, you startled me. How could you startle me already? Again. Damn it. Okay, one of these has to have something. And I gotta find that something before I run out of freaking flashlight. Which is bound to happen soonish. What the hell was that? Did I close that? Was that me? It's gotta be written on one of the stalls or something. Where? There's gotta be a number in here. Sink, sink, sink. Wait, is it in one of the other notes? No to Dr. Patrick. Nope. 
nope, it's not in any of the other notes. It's got to be in here somewhere. Come to that conclusion. Wait, what's this? Hey! Is there going to be something creepy coming out of there? Is there something, something in there? Nothing. Just a bunch of nothing. Good. What if I jump up on this sink? Or this sink? Okay, I'm going to run out of flashlight, like, real soon. Is there something written on that now? No? So if I blank to bleh, there's a vent here. And that's where I just was. So five is first, two is third, and your mom is twelfth, based on logic. Shut up, doors! Okay, there's gotta be something. Something I missed in this room. Number? You got a number for me? I don't see any numbers in there. You got a, you got a number? I need a number. I need a number real soon here. Before I go crazy. Absolutely bonkers. It's already happening. I can feel it. Plus, it's hot as shit in here. Okay. Enough of that. Okay, so five, four, two, one. Five, six, two, one. Five, three, two, one. Uh, five, two, three, one. Five, three, two, one. Five, one, two, four? I'm just guessing here. Maybe I should keep looking for clues. It's got to be written in one of the other rooms. That bathroom, I, I fail to believe that there's absolutely nothing there. There's got to be something up here. Reveal your secrets. And if I miss something obvious, and I don't get it by the end of this episode, first of all, punch me in the face via comment. And second of all, isn't this where Philip was? Isn't this the dark evil where Philip was? Is he still in here? I bet he is. Nope, I'm getting out of here. I don't think it's in here. It is way too hot in here. I am like dripping. Very uncomfortably. Okay. Meeting room. We're gonna find it in here. Because this meeting room can't just be purposeless. And I'm out of flashlight. Swell. Grand. Come on. Something happened. I'm gonna find this. I will find it if it takes me 5,000 years, which it just might. It just might take me 5,000 years. The way things are going, I just might not find it. Ever in this lifetime. I'm gonna die and wake up in freaking 1904. Wait, was there something down here? Something down in the creepy evil? That I missed? Well, I wouldn't know now, because it's way too dark. God damn it. I'm sick of dark. I am really sick of dark. Is there a light? A light I can replace or something? Because I can't see. Great, now I'm stuck. Son of a bitch. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I was looking down, apparently. Wait. What am I looking at? Oh, that's the stairs. Okay, I'm trying to... I'm just trying to remember the layout of this place. Hood. Nothing. Good. Grand. Oh, God. I don't want to be stuck here. And I'm pretty much stuck without a flashlight. Without a functioning flashlight, I'm just... Bu -bu 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 boned, boned, boned. To quote a now famous band. Hot. Hot. Too hot. Let's look through more notes. No. 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 It's a four digit and it's five bleh two four. Five two two one. 
five, two, two, three, five, six, three, two, five, four, two, one, five, three, two, six, five, son of a bitch. We're just going to forget this is happening. And we're going to just have a lovely little conversation about finding things. So, what's the coolest thing you've ever found? Oh, that, huh? Yeah, I can see how you would think that's the coolest. I mean, not my choice. It wouldn't, it wouldn't be my choice, but, you know, whatever. I just need to know one more number. If I can just get one more number, then. But, but that's not important. Let's, let's continue talking about the things you found in your life. Oh, nothing. Just a bunch of nothing? Oh. Man, that's boring. Sorry. I just don't know how else to put it. It's just, it's just boring. God damn it. What am I doing? Not gonna get angry. Not gonna get angry. Oh, how did I miss this note here? In 1878, the State Lunatic Hospital at Denver was erected. <laughs> Erect. <laughs> it means to, to build, to a building, make the, make the building stand. Under the supervision of prominent Boston architect Nathaniel J. Bradley in an extremely rural, out of the way location. The immediate crisis which precipitated the building of a mental hospital north of Boston was the imminence in the early 1870s of the closing of the facility in South Boston. 1873, Worcester, Taunton, and Northampton, and the 1869, the first running patients were already housing 1,300 patients in the building designed for 1,000. Another 1,200 were scattered about in various other hospitals. <laughs> While the hospital was originally established to provide residential treatment and care to the mentally ill, its functions expanded to include a training program for nurses in 1889 and a pathological research laboratory in 1895. <laughs> By the 1920s, the hospital was operating school clinics self determined mental deficiency in children. During the 1960s, the uh, result of increased emphasis on alternative methods of treatment at the end of the the inpatient population started to decrease. The first state hospital closed on June 24th, 1992. Hey, that was like a year and 14 days after I was born. Coincidence? I think not. Due to budget cuts within the mental health system. In 1998, the Denver uh, well, opened again by Dr. Diane Zellwin and began to undergo a partial week construction to meet the modern day standards. After countries, one of the most respectable directors, Patrick Pa, joined the hospital crew. Reputation of the hospital started to increase. However, the still out of the way location left an average impression throughout the country. Today, Denver State Hospital is a forgotten and desolate place. So that didn't help me at all. Too frustrated for backstory right now. If I had found that earlier, I would have been totally cool with it. Doctor, that must be Dr. Surly, her, or whatever her name was. Okay, we're just gonna to try some combinations again. Five, four, two, three. Five, six, two, four. Five, three, two, two. Five, two, two, two. Five, four, two, six. Fuck. Literally the only thing I have solved in this episode is that the freaking... First number is five, and that the uh, third number is two. Got to be some writing on one of these, one of these things or something. I don't know. Let me just let me just try to make this a little bit better. To make this a little less stupid on my part. I, I mean, I doubt it's gonna happen. There are three lamps there. Does that mean anything? Probably not. Boxes, reveal. The secrets behind this place. Number one is five. There's got to be something in that room with the TV. I'm going to check there one more time. I got to end the episode. And in the next one, I will totally look it up. Figure this shit out. It's ridiculous. Whole episode of nothing! And if you find it out, good lord, just leave a comment. Wait, does that say something on it? No. No, it doesn't. There's got to be a, a code somewhere. There's got to be something. I refuse to accept that there's a lack of anything here. Freaking TV. Just now go for the TV. Is it on the desk? It's not. 
in here. Secrets. Secrets. I can't see in that corner, so I don't know if there's anything written there. Probably isn't. Let's get the screwdriver. And, uh, zoop. That's what I ended the last episode with. So what a good spot to end! Oh god, did you guys see anything I missed? I'm sorry. This custom story is good, but it's just very, uh, I'm, I'm just not good at it. Basically. So I gotta end the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Click the annotation at the top right of the video to see more games that I've played. Be sure to leave a comment if you saw anything that could help me out, because I'm just a complete loss here. And be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed the video as well, and I will see you guys on the next episode of White Knight. See you later! Something toilet?